啊。You certainly don't look like a blood-crazed revolutionary. The hood is a bit sinister, though, if you don't mind my saying. Serving as rear guard, are you? Convenient how that puts several locked doors between you and the fighting. Oh, I'm not here at all. Not officially, anyway. But how often does one find the opportunity to poke about in a king's private study? Looking for anything in particular? State secrets, private correspondences, personal treasures, that sort of thing. I do hope we're not eyeing the same prize. Name it. Certain letters written to the king, ripe for misunderstanding, should the wrong men find them. I see. Well, then perhaps we can help each other. I believe the king has built a hidden vault somewhere in here. If only we could find it. Was saying. Very nicely done, my friend. Incredible. Find your prize. A cornucopia, yes. And you? Believe so. Yes. This is it. That should take care of that. And may I suggest we leave? Quickly. What is that? Our way out. Cover me, would you? Let's go. Search everything! I want those documents! Him! Damn! Yes, Captain Rui has that effect on people. Friend of yours? Persistent thorn I haven't quite managed to pluck out. He has information I need. I need to get back up there! In this mess, you'll never find him again. Come with me, I have a better idea. You handled yourself well back there. I don't suppose you've ever considered military service? I'm not much for following orders. Ah, the bane of generals and statesmen everywhere. An individualist. I know the feeling. Men like us have a great advantage over most in the army. You see, we can think for ourselves. If you joined up today, you'd be a marshal in ten years, guaranteed. A generous offer. But no. Where the heart leads, a man must follow. Look me up if you ever change your mind. Bonaparte is my name. Napoleon Bonaparte. Second lieutenant of artillery. For now. Arno Dorian. A pleasure. And as a personal favor, if anyone asks, I was never here. Watch the whole thing from a furniture shop across the carousel. A face in the crowd, of course. What now? Just a moment. You may want to take cover. Everything all right, sir? Fine, Corporal. Superb shot. Regular drills are critical to a regiment's success. We should be going, sir. We part ways here. What about Rui? Give me a few days. I'll see what I can learn of his current posting. Perhaps I can arrange an introduction. Be well. This morning, I was accosted by three men carrying some poor soul's head atop a pike. Seems they mistook my uniform for a mark of nobility and demanded I shout, Long live the Republic, to prove my allegiance. I suppose handing out tricolor cockades is now passé. What did you do? I shouted, Long live the Republic. A man of principle. Life 
is more valuable than dignity. But this is what happens when you give command of the government to half-starved lunatics and command of the army to bloodthirsty savages. Rui. I wanted him assigned to some out-of-the-way garrison, but the man redefines the term friends in high places. He's untouchable. But you know where I can find him. Rumor about the barracks is that he and a unit of his cronies plan on marching on the Grand Châtelet this afternoon. If he were to meet with an accident, few in France would suffer. My career certainly wouldn't. Well, practice your speech making. It concerns my fiancée, Desiree Clary. Some sans-culotte plan to abduct her for a ransom. Captain Bernadotte knows the particulars. Join him in front of the post office and ensure that Desiree escapes her house unharmed. I suspect that Captain Bernadotte has fallen in love with my fiancée, and I cannot abide the thought. As I must dine with her this evening, I would ask that you search Bernadotte's house near the Palais Royal and determine his feelings on the matter. But what am I to do about Desiree? I need a strategy. What are you doing here? Don't distract me. Perhaps a tactical retreat on the Desiree front. And as for Josephine, march to the sound of the guns. Yes. With Josephine, a flanking maneuver. And oh, what flanks. What? Oh, those old letters? Get rid of them. Josephine has conquered me now. No, 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 Captain, for now, I have prospects, though. I'm sure. Very good prospects. Well, it's a lovely day for a walk. Oh, oh, um, yes, of course. Shall we? I was born in Martinique. I came to France to marry, but that was a disaster. I'm now a divorcee. Oh. And you? Where did you acquire your exotic accent? Corsica. How delightfully provincial of you. You are a pensive man. What? Oh, yes. I was just musing about how I could maneuver, um, how I could... Take my arm? Yes. And have you formed a plan? No. The life of a soldier must be terribly exciting. Cavalry charges and flashing blades. I'm in the artillery. Oh. We stand at the back and lob cannonballs at people. I calculate trajectories. Fascinating. Well, this has been... I've, uh... You... Yes, it has, hasn't it? It's just that your... Your... Those large, luminous... Those... Eyes? Yes. They are bewitching. I can barely breathe, talk, think. We must meet again. Oh. Yes, perhaps. Well, ta-ta. I think that went pretty well. You ever meet a noble, Leon? You ever heard a noble talk? Descended from God, they were. Threads of gold arc from between their blessed legs into holy chamber pots. <laughs> then, Leon. Fountains of rubies spilled from their necks and rained down upon all of France. Now, a man born deep within the lowest circle of hell can rise to the very top of Olympus itself. Unhand me, Connor! Is that what you want, little man? To rise up? I see it in you. Ambition. You're just like me. Rose. Commandant Bonaparte. Any progress to report? Only this. Find me the door that this key unlocks. 
and I shall reward you beyond your wildest dreams. What is behind the door? This is our petite trespasser. Who are you calling little? I'm nearly as tall Should... as... You need to learn a bit of diplomacy. Rose, I trust you'll show the boy to the surface. Of course, Commandant. Why do you employ such a man as Rose to find the temple? He does nothing for us or our aims. If I was in your place, I would not pander what to... What does a rat want? Food, of course. Ah. You appeal to their self-interest. But you have miscalculated. <laughs> your people are dead. I know human animal. What you fear, what you love. Is Rose a bad man? Undoubtedly. But I, Napoleon, can control him and turn him to what is best for France. The masses will gladly renounce their freedom if all can entertain the hope of rising to the top. The artifact inside the temple, I will bring them the illusion of hope. I will lead us to glory.